Hey guys, tomorrow is the new moon in Sagittarius. I hope you're prepared. To me, it personally, it sounds exciting. Uh, the new moon in Sagittarius means fresh and bold new starts in the area of where Sagittarius rules, Jupiter, and the ninth house. So you could go to your horoscope. I think I showed you guys before how to check where um, the new moon is going to be in your personal chart. But in general, the new moon, especially it's going to, it's pretty much the meaning is, it's in Sagittarius. So anything Sagittarius related is going to be affected. Um, of course, Sagittarius is the planet of expansion. The archetype, you know, symbolizes expansion. So wherever you have Sagittarius, the ninth house, whatever ninth house placement, those are the areas that's gonna, you know, be affected. So with the Sagittarius new moon, to me personally, it's time to think about going back to school. If that's something that you want to do, um, higher education, Sagittarius rules, adventure. So if you want to take a trip, you know, New Year's is com New Year is coming. So new moon, and this is the last new moon of. The year so if you want to plan on taking a lot of trips next year is probably this time is probably a good time to plant the seeds of you know taking adventures next year and start planning for those things because Sagittarius rules um, adventure and long distance adventure at that so those are the things two major things that you could look at within this new moon so the new moon is in the sixth house and the sixth house is your work and health zone which the planet usually that's there that is virgo so if you know virgoans they're very virgoians how do you say that i don't know type it in the chat and let me know um so if you know virgos you know they are all about health so the sixth house is also about health and also about work so look at your of course you could utilize this information right um of the sagittarius new moon so you could utilize it to plant new seeds in adventure, taking adventure, higher education, but also maybe to look for a new job because the moon is new moon is in the sixth house, and also maybe your health. So these are outside factors, but if you want to see how they affect you personally, you want to go back. I put it before, or I could post it again if you want. Um, on my page how to look at the new moon and how it affects you personally so Jupiter is currently in Taurus in the sixth house uh, so that of course since May that has been affecting all of us me personally I'm gonna do a separate vlog about that because I personally <laughs> expanded and I'm gonna show my pictures from May till now and see how Oh, how expanded I've gotten <laughs> from then till now. Um, but again, you could check out how, where, you know, your personal, I'm going to do a blog on that, how to look at Jupiter, um, how that affects you personally, how you could check that out on Astro Seek. Um, but for now you could check out how the moon, you know, where the moon's placements are, or how the moon's placements are going to currently affect you. See which house and then in general just check where jupiter is in your chart um and where where your sagittarius where which planet sagittarius is in and the ninth house but as far as outside if you want to manifest stuff right now would be good to think about stuff that is related to of course sagittarius jupiter the ninth house and the sixth house and then the sixth house is ruled by Virgo. So you might want to take a step further and see where Virgo is in your chart. But that's more or less it. Um, this new moon, it's pretty, to me, pretty simple. Um, the essential oil that I personally recommend for the sixth house is tea tree essential oil. Well, tea tree oil is good for emotional balance, mental clarity. Um... And you could add, you know, a blend that you could do is one drop of tea tree oil, one drop of clary sage. You could add that to your wrist, your bath, or to your burner, and that will help you out 
for the sixth house um i have several essential oils for jupiter in general so let me see i have cypress which is uh fresh sweet uh piney woodsy and balsamic frankincense um, rose geranium heliochrysum lavender lemon palmarosa peppermint rosemary so those you could add into a blend um, or you could just use singularly um, single as a single oil um, to make a blend uh, for your new moon but personally i think maybe to use the tea tree oil you know just to gain some mental clarity that oil is recommended for the sixth house and all the other oils is just in general like good oils good sagittarius freedom oils per se um and that's more or less it um make sure that you like and follow and also drop a comment and let me know which planets you have in the ninth house and sign and also where is your sagittarius and yeah so drop a comment let me know ciao